Alpha Bravo to Tango, we are about to approach the animal. And I'm sorry for the mic quality, this is why I'm making this impression. It's because I'm having ground looping problems in my home, so I have to use a wireless headset. So it's not going to sound as clean. Right, the point of this tutorial today is to very quickly show how to get a clean kill off an animal without all those other tricks. You know, you see the tricks online where you get a little trinket or uh, certain places where you shoot the animal. There's actually a very easy way to distinguish how to get a clean kill on a certain kind of animal. Now, unfortunately, I have just lost an animal and I'm going to call my horse so we can find one. And you won't believe how actually easy it is. It's so simple and you guarantee nothing. 90% of the time to actually get a clean kill on the animal that you are trying to hunt from the smallest little mouse to the biggest buffalo you can get a one shot clean kill without disrupting its fur and without needing any fancy equipment to actually use it here we have an animal right here we see this little buck running here it's a white tail deer and its fur is on good now while I'm busy hunting it and I'm pointing my gun I go to show info now you'll look on there on the left hand side at the bottom you'll see use and crafting cooking can be sold use a rifle for a clean kill so it's actually telling you to use a certain type of gun so here's a Springfield rifle and I'm going to try and shoot it now now I know you can rope it in that's the other way to get a clean kill and that's a lot more entertaining but uh, let's just lock on lock on to this animal now let's go remember it was on good the fur was on good so it should still be on good and there it is it's still on good I've still got a good clean kill on an animal that uh, ideally if I'd shot with anything else would have actually been quite rubbish so we're gonna leave that animal there um, we don't want it it's on good let's try find something else that is lurking in the woods so to speak um, maybe something smaller a bird a little rat a squirrel, a rabbit, a bunny, anything. Don't worry, no real animals are harmed in this making of the video. So calm your roll, Peter. And oh, well, we got a big animal. Oh, there we go. So again, that's a buck. And if we look, a long scope rifle for a clean kill. So I happen to have one right here. If I can just stop this over here. Oh God, I heard it when. Oh, 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 oh. Ah. You know what I really hate is when I'm pointing at the wrong place with the rifle. Okay, 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 okay. We get, we get it, we get it. The oh, and this horse does not want to stop. Okay, so we're gonna get off the horse because the horse is being a pain in my ass. Like seriously, a big pain in my ass. It just won't stop running. Uh, let's go track him. We got ourselves a white deer over here. We're gonna find it. Now, yes, I'm not using any of the little ways to hide myself, the little uh, scents and all that, because I'm trying to do this rather quickly. And I think I see it. Is it over there? I see bushes moving. Seriously? You ran all the way up here. Is that what you want to be? Like, um, I'd like to actually thank uh, my good friend Charles. I was playing with him online a few days ago. Uh, his user take a spinal crack. Um, he actually told me this and my mind was absolutely thrown for a loop because I'd been roping in animals, I'd been trying to get that perfect headshot and it turns out I actually didn't really need to worry about that. Yes, you get it into the kill zone, but uh, generally most of the time if you have a good weapon, the right weapon I should say, you can get a, a clean kill. There's some wild boars over there. Uh, let's, try, let's try find a, a good one. Uh, Goodness, if I can get out of this mode, that'll be fantastic. Okay, let's take a look at this. Use a rifle for a clean kill. So I'm going to use my rifle. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Ooh. TB. Oh, uh, other organ. And shoot. I, I, I actually didn't hit it in the head. It turned as I was going there. So technically now, this should be... Oh, look. Perfect. Perfect. Isn't this amazing? Look at my white gloves, Michael Jackson, Mickey Mouse. Hee <laughs> hee. Aha. Either way. But now I've got the perfect skin. Because I was using that very simple process. So there you go, guys. Very, very quick. 
But I've used two very uh, um, different experiments with two very different guns because, like I said, one of them you use a, the, it says sometimes use a repeater, sometimes it says use a long range scope, so it's good to have a rolling block rifle, and other times it'll actually tell you when to use a small. Now, it's no use doing this because it's uh, so. It's on poor already, so it can't get really any lower. But um, but there it is. It basically tells you there's a bird up there. If we actually look at the raven, if it tries to look at the raven, that'll be great. Show info. Use a small game bow to get a to get a kill on that. So that's where you'll get your perfect feathers and your perfect body. So I hope this helps. This will obviously make your other quests a lot easier to do. What the heck is going... Every single time I do a video, I seem to find dead bodies all around. Look at this. Who dumped all this here? <laughs> oh my gosh, this is like, we shall all die together. We haven't been getting any deer, so we're going <laughs> to kill ourselves. Oh, wow, really? Gee whiz, it's like, seriously, this is this is genocide, deer, den well, buck genocide, but... All of them in one go. But anyway, guys, I thought that's a very nice way to end of the video. What the buck? And uh, we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.